Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new Tech Reviews and Gadgets episode where today we're reviewing a smart Wi-Fi power strip and you guys are currently watching Clearly. video we're reviewing a smart Wi-Fi PAL strip from the company Tekken and this is actually the model SS30N and you guys can see we do get included with four USA ports and we also get four USB ports with this smart Wi-Fi PAL strip um, the great thing about this PAL strip is you guys can virtually connect it um, to any device and then have um, switches for each of the ports. So I could have eight different devices connected to this surge protected power strip and control them at any given time and at any given moment. But before we get started with this tech reviews and gadgets episode, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts whenever we do upload. Have any questions or concerns about this smart Wi-Fi power strip? Make sure you guys go down below and leave a comment as I reply and read every single comment I do receive. If you guys do enjoy this video after watching it, I would really appreciate it if you guys went down below and left a like as that informs me and keeps me updated if you guys are enjoying this series. Follow us on our various social media platforms down below in the description. You guys can follow us to stay connected and also have a quicker way of reaching out to me. Our business increase email is creweliteyt at outlook.com. If you guys want to send me any messages or want to potentially work with us, you guys can do so with that email address. And then lastly, if you guys actually want to purchase this product or get more information about this smart Wi-Fi uh, PAL strip, you guys can do so with the link provided in the description and also product information down below in the description if you guys want to get more information about this smart Wi-Fi power strip. But right now, what we're gonna do is actually move on to the first look and unboxing portion of this video. As you guys can see, the front of the box, you know, it's a fairly simple packaging design. You guys can see there's a picture of the power strip. And as I fin uh, spin this around, you guys can see there's a few specifications and details on the side of the box. So what we're going to do is actually shift this onto a secondary camera angle so you guys can have a closer shot at this product. But as you guys can see on the front of the box, it says Tekken, and there's a picture of the smart Wi-Fi power strip. This is the SS30N model, and this is a smart power strip. On this side, you guys can see there's a few specifications. And then on this side, you guys can see there's a few specifications and details. You guys can take a pause and read that if you're interested. But right now, we're gonna proceed to actually unbox this smart uh, PAL strip. And you guys can see, we're instantly greeted with a user manual on top of the PAL strip. You guys need to use this manual to get more information and details on the setup process. And I do recommend to read this so you guys don't run into any issues with the setup process of this smart PAL strip. We're gonna put it off to the side for now. And if you take a, uh, this box part out, so you guys can see the cable just comes out like that. And now you can actually take this smart PAL strip and take the bag out. And that's honestly all it is for the packaging. So what I want to do is actually construct this box and move it off to the side. But as you guys can see on the secondary camera angle, this is everything that's included with the packaging. You know, we got the smart um, PAL strip and then we got the user manual. And that's all it is with this packaging. So all that's left to do is move on to the testing and demonstration portion where we actually test out this smart PAL strip. So the first thing we need to do is actually unwrap this uh, PAL extension cable. I'm not exactly sure how big it is. I think it's only probably mm, maybe three feet long. And what I'm gonna need to do is actually take an extension cable so we can actually plug this into the PAL source. And I'm gonna plug it into, let's just plug it into this one. And I'm gonna face this onto this camera angle so you guys can have a shot of this PAL strip. So I think all that's left to do is we need to actually um, get onto the Smart Life application so we can connect this to my phone. So what we need to do is, you should be able to see my phone screen right now, we need to open up the Smart Life application and we need to actually power on this Smart Power Strip. So it's on right now, you guys can see the LED lights are actually very faint, so I don't know if you guys can actually see that, but the LED indication lights are actually white 
and I think we should be good to go. So the next thing we need to do is actually go to this plus button and we need to add manually and I think it's gonna be PAL strip Wi-Fi. And it's gonna ask you for your Wi-Fi credentials. All you need to do is type in your Wi-Fi credentials and proceed to the next step. Um, for us, it's actually not blinking yet. So maybe I need to hold down the power button. So we are good to go. Um, I did need to mention if you hold down this button, the Wi-Fi light, I don't know if you guys can see because my studio lights are very bright, will start blinking. And all you need to do is wait for it to actually connect to your, um, uh, what is it called, your Wi-Fi connection and also to your application. And as you guys can see, the smart Wi-Fi power strips connected successfully to my application. So now we need to do is click on done. And now we can actually go in and actually control this smart Wi-Fi PAL strip. Um, I have a few devices that we're gonna connect to it, but I'm not gonna uh, connect too many things. Um, we have this um, lamp that we're gonna connect to one of these ports. We're gonna do it for this one. And now let me take this and plug it into, let's do this one. And this is just like a little dinosaur thing. Um, I'm going to put it off to this side. I'm going to also plug in my phone for one of them so we can see if my phone does get powered up and charged. And I'm going to plug it into one of these USB ports. I do need to mention that the USB ports, you can't control each separate USB port, but you can with the standard uh, ports for, you know, plugs and stuff like, you know, the USA plug. Um, you can control each of them manually, but for the USB ports, you have to control the whole set of four. And now if I click on all on, you guys are going to see everything turn on. So let me click on that. And you guys can see everything is on, including this dinosaur thing. And my phone is getting charged up. So I plugged in the dinosaur on switch one, and I plugged in this lamp on switch four. So if I click on switch one, the dinosaur turns off, turn it back on, it turns back on, switch four. Um, the lamp should turn off, turn it back on, and you guys can see it turns on and off. So it works perfectly fine. Um, you can go in and actually set a uh, schedule and time information onto each of these ports. So that's really fa uh, fantastic. Um, you guys can, um, what is it called? Go in and still control this uh, USB switches. So right now if I click on the USB switch, um, it's gonna actually stop charging my phone. But if I click it back on, you guys can see my phone is getting charged up. So everything works fine. If I click on all off, everything turns on, or I should say off. And if I click on all on, everything turns back on. So it works perfectly fine. Um, you can go in, you know, this is the whole customization menu. Um, I think I, you can even go in and actually rename this smart PAL strip if you are interested in renaming it into something else. And then the great thing is you can use third party control. So you guys can use Alexa, Google Assistant, and IFTTT. So if you guys use any of those applications, you can actually connect it to those applications and actually, you know, virtually connect them at any given time and use voice control to connect to this smart Wi-Fi PAL strip. And I'm pretty sure you can even go in and name each of these switches. So if this was like switch one, I can name it dinosaur. And if switch four, I can name it nightstand lamp or you know, something like that. And I can easily go, hey Google, can you turn on dinosaur? And it can turn on that light for you. So you can go in and actually rename all these switches and then have Google and Amazon Alexa connected to them. And you can use voice control uh, prompts to actually um, virtually connect these uh, smart PAL strips. But I think that is gonna conclude our test. So right now what we're gonna do is actually move on to the final reflections and remarks and then end off this video. So one of my final opinions and remarks about this Tekken S. 30N Smart Power Strip. Honestly, it's a fantastic uh, smart power strip. If you guys have many devices that you want to connect and virtually, you know, control at any given time, I do recommend this, you know. And the great thing about this smart power strip is it's surge protected. And if there's a massive increase of the power going through this cable, it will actually manually shut off and actually protect your devices and also this power strip. So there's so many safety features and mechanisms that this smart power strip has to offer. There is an LED indication light for each of the USB and also the, uh, what is it called, the USA ports underneath. So you guys can see which ones are on and off and which ones are off at any given time. And then I'm pretty sure this cable itself is about three feet long. I might be mistaken. It might be a little shorter than that, but I think it's about three feet long. So, you know, it's a pretty long extension cable. And I just love how adorable this smart power strip really is. 
But right now, we're all going to conclude this video. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed this Tech Reviews and Gadgets episode. And if you guys did, make sure you guys go down below and hit that subscribe button and turn on post notifications on to get updates and alerts whenever we do upload. Have any questions or concerns about this smart power strip, make sure you guys go down below and leave a comment as I reply and read every single comment I do receive. If you guys enjoyed this video after watching it, make sure you guys go down below and leave a like as that informs me and keeps me updated if you guys are enjoying this tech series. Um, if you guys want to follow us on our various social media platforms, our social media accounts and links are down below in the description. You guys can follow us to stay connected and also get updates whenever we do upload. Our business increase email is crewelyt at outlook.com. You guys can shoot me a message if you want to potentially work with me or if you guys need any photo assistance, you guys can do so by contacting me through my business increase email. And then lastly, if you guys actually want to check out this product or get more information about this smart power strip, there will be a link down below and also more product information down below in the description for you guys to check out alongside with the link to make a purchase. But that is going to end off our video for today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this tech reviews and gadgets episode. And if you guys did, make sure to do all those things as I mentioned. And I hope to see you guys all on the next episode. Crew Elite signing out. Thank you guys all for watching and have a good rest of your day.